Good day to all of you. Myself, Dr. Arvind Sharma, Associate Professor in Physics Government, Dogar College, Bikaner. Today's MSc final topic is Microwave Transmission and Communication Systems, Chapter, Unit 4. You are going through Paper 7th A. Electronics, Digital Electronics and Communication Electronics. In Unit 4, second chapter is there is no name of the chapter, just I quote a statement for this chapter. This is not the name of exactly the chapter. You go through or you Learn about the microwave transmission and communication systems in this chapter. Okay. What is the syllabus? Advantage and disadvantage of microwave transmission. This is first topic of your this chapter. Advantage and disadvantage of microwave transmission. Second one is loss in free space. Third, propagation of microwaves. Atmospheric effects on propagation, frictional zone problem, ground reflection, fading sources, detectors, components, antennas used in microwave communication systems. That means which are detectors that can be used in microwave communication systems, components, antennas, Antennas used in microwave communication systems. Now, first topic advantage and disadvantage of microwave transmission. We know that microwave transmission uses frequency range from 300 megahertz to 300 gigahertz to carry signals. These waves travel in a straight line. Very important point that the waves travel in a straight line and cannot penetrate buildings. This is disadvantage of microwave communication. Cannot penetrate buildings. These uses big antennas. Big antennas called microwave towers to send and receive data. To send and receive data, microwave transmission uses big antennas known as microwave towers. You usually seen everywhere. Now, what are the properties of microwaves? Following are the main properties of microwaves. Microwaves are waves that radiate electromagnetic energy with shorter wavelength. Radiate electromagnetic energy with shorter wavelength. Okay. Microwaves are not reflected by ionosphere. Point to be noted that ionosphere does not reflect the microwaves. Microwaves travel in a straight line. This is a very important point that is used for line of sight. We study a topic line of sight in this chapter also that uses the straight line propagation of microwaves and reflected by the conducting surfaces reflected by the conducting surfaces. Microwaves are easily attenuated within shorter distances. Microwaves are easily attenuated with shorter distances. Microwave currents can flow through a thin layer of cable. Very important point. Microwave currents Microwave currents can flow through a thin layer of a cable. 
thin layer of a kin. Okay. Now, what are the advantages of microwaves? There are many advantages of microwaves, such as the following. Okay. Supports larger bandwidth. Supports larger bandwidth. Hence, more information is transmitted. Due to larger bandwidth, more information is transmitted. For this reason, microwaves are used for point-to-point -point communications. Point-to-point -point communications is related with larger bandwidth. More engine again is possible. More antenna again is possible. Higher data rates are transmitted as the bandwidth is more. Higher data rates are transmitted because they have larger bandwidth. Because they have larger bandwidth. Okay. Antenna size gets reduced. Very important point. Antenna size gets reduced as the frequencies are higher. Because frequencies are higher, hence antenna size gets reduced. Low power consumption. Low power consumption. As the signals are of higher frequencies. Because signals are of higher frequencies, hence low power consumption. Okay. Effect of fading. We learn about this point in this chapter. Fading sources. Effect of fading gets reduced by using the line of sight propagation. Effect of fading gets reduced by using the line of sight propagation. Okay. If you use the line of sight propagation, then fading effect can be reduced. Provides effective reflection area in the radar systems. Provides Effective reflection area in the radar systems. Satellite and terrestrial communications with high capacities are possible. Satellite and terrestrial communications with high capabilities are possible. Low cost miniature microwave components can be developed. Very important application low cost miniature microwave components. That means cost is very low and is small in size that have microwave components and they can be developed. Effective spectrum uses with wide variety of applications. Effective spectrum. Effective spectrum uses with wide variety of applications in all available frequency ranges of operation. These are useful in transmitting data high any difficult terrain. Transmitting data high any difficult terrain. Towers for these waves can be set up at the top of a building. Towers can be, towers of these waves can be set up at the top of the building to send and receive microwaves. To send and receive microwaves, the transmitting and receiving antennas, transmitting and receiving antennas should be aligned because these waves travel in a straight line. A straight line propagation is a very important property of microwaves. Okay. 
so to send and receive microwaves the transmitting and receiving antenna should be aligned this is a necessary or compulsory part for microwave communications that is the alignment of transmitting and receiving antennas are necessary disadvantages of microwaves what are the disadvantages of microwaves there are a few disadvantages of microwaves such as the following cost of equipment or installation cost is high cost of equipment and installation cost is high they are empty and occupy more space more space is necessary for it electromagnetic interference may occur in electromagnetic interference may occur variations in dielectric properties with temperature may occur that is a very important point for research also variations in dielectric properties with temperatures may occur okay inherent inefficiency of electric power inefficiency of electric power the signals sent through microwave are not secure the signals are not secure which are sent through microwaves the cost of setting up microwaves is more than that of radio waves cost is also another disadvantage factor for microwaves because it is more than radio waves these signals are impacted by weather conditions very important signals are impacted by weather conditions that you all observe who are using tata sky dish tv dth airtel any kind of antennas for transmission then when atmosphere is not good then there is no signal on your tv a small question what are the some major advantage and disadvantage of microwave transmission if a small answer you should know about that how you can give a small answer the main disadvantage of microwave transmission is that microwave towers can exchange data only if they have a clear line of sight between them with no obstacles such as buildings slopes or trees in the way if there are two antennas or towers then there should be no obstacles between them hence the towers are set up on the top of the buildings different disadvantages incorporate signal absorption signal absorption by the atmosphere weather obstruction and cost an advantage of microwave transmission is that rather than utilizing cables or other physical wires it utilizes electromagnetic waves with small wavelengths the measure of the wavelengths allow it transmitter to direct microwaves to a beneficiary in a narrow beam enhancing effectiveness so we understand about the what are the advantages and disadvantages of microwaves this is the first topic of your this chapter this question can be asked in section a and b both so you just change your answer according to word limit i already suggest you that your answer should be according to the word limit that is very important so the length of the question is important 
due to this every topic can be prepared like that you can answer any kind of word limit in your paper okay thanks to all of you